Yo, what's up my amazing audience? My name is Tricky Acid and in this video, it's all about technology. Usually I'm always on about gaming. Gaming is a forefront on my channel. However, I'm also a huge technology enthusiast. So I decided why don't I branch my channel out to a more of a tech area as well as gaming. So here and there, I may just do a few videos about tech that I enjoy because I love computers. I actually come from a technical computer background with my degree and things like that, for those of you who didn't know. But um, that being said, I do follow quite a few um, people on YouTube itself. Bam. <laughs> They're awesome. So yeah, they were quite a big inspiration for me to do this. And I decided, why don't we kick it off with the brand new NVIDIA GTX 1080. So yesterday, NVIDIA had their press conference, it was live on Twitch, they showed off some pretty cool stuff, 360 stereo, virtual reality, through your phone even, using Google Cardboard, for example. Pretty nuts. However, I've got an iPhone, but hey, it still works. The highlight of the show, in my opinion, still was the GTX 1080 and the 1070. The main bulk of this video is going to be all about the 1080. The simple fact being is that it is not only faster, but it is cheaper than the Titan X. The GTX 1080 has this new cutting edge design. No pun intended, but I love this shot effect with the sharp angles and grooves and it looks great. Nvidia are actually calling this card the new king of gaming, and rightfully so. The 1080 is boasting 8GB of GDDR5X video RAM, which clocks in at around 10GHz. On top of that, the 1080 is packing 9 teraflops, in contrast to the Titan X, which uses 7 teraflops. In fact, the 1080 is around 30% faster than the Titan X. And if you take a closer look at this graph, it's not only faster, but even consumes far less power, hanging around the 180 wattage mark, whereas the Titan X is eating away far more on your energy bills. On top of that, for those of you who love your SLI configurations, it's even faster than two 980s strapped together, which is roughly around 6.5 teraflops. Now here's a shot of the 1080 using the new SLI plate and it looks awesome. I love it! But one thing to point out is that it's using only one 8-pin connector to power it up. Unlike the Titan X, which needs two. One 6-pin and one 8-pin. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure I'm correct. But anyways, honestly, this new 1080 card is ticking all the boxes and it's already kicking the Titan X to the curb. And in terms of cooling, I read online that on high performance scenarios, it was hitting around the 65 to 67 degrees. Personally, I'd have preferred a lower temperature, but that's what's so fun about building your own rig after all. And for a stock cooling unit, I think it's still pretty decent. And look guys, I'm back. But guess what? It is night time. Yes. Throughout editing this video, I had to go out and, I don't know, save the planet and things like that because, you know, I, um, I'm Batman. But anyways, yeah, back to the video. Now let's talk about pricing. So, the Titan X is priced at around $999, I believe, or $900. Whereas, for me in the UK, the cheapest I found the Titan X was around £880. Brand new! And let me just see how much that is in dollars. So what we'll do is we'll go on my iPhone. We're gonna go on to <laughs> uh, XE and check it out. Eight hundred and eighty pounds in dollars is one thousand two hundred and sixty-nine dollars. Once again, the UK gets completely ripped. Yep, that's just how things roll. Anyway, uh, in terms of the GTX 1080 for the standard edition you're looking at $599 which is a phenomenal price and if you do want to go for the special founders edition it is $699 right with that all being said guys I hope you enjoyed this video it was my first tech video so let me know on your feedback it'll be great if you just type it all up in the comment section below Hey, are you guys going to go for the 1080 or the 1070 even? 
or um, do one of you guys even have the Titan X? How do you guys feel about that? You know, let me know. Let me know, because I love to engage with you guys. So May twenty seventh is the launch date for the ten eighty, and I also believe the ten seventy. So if you guys are gonna grab it, jump on the Nvidia site, and hey, just get it. Okay, guys, please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and subscribe if you haven't already, so you guys can tune into more videos by me. Thank you for watching, and peace out.